morning guys, let's start my day. I will show, just make a small tour here in the hotel. That's the toilet, it's pretty small. But there's something cool, you know, like this toilet here, they shower your ass and it's pretty comfortable. Here is the bed, also pretty compact. But there is something cool that I want to show you. If you check with the window, you can see the, the Tokyo Tower over there. Tonight, today you can see because it's a bit cloudy, but last night was beautiful. That's the view of uh, our balcony. So we have this amazing view from Tokyo. Check it out. It's, um, it's unfortunately it's raining today. I don't know what we would we do, but let's explore the city. Just start the day here, né? so as always, like the morning, get a hundred yens and get a ice coffee. So I'm trying every day one different one. Today I want to try the boss one, black. Let's try the black one from boss. So, uh, here's the coffee, black one. Let's start the day. We got some snacks on the 7 Eleven. First, bowls in the shape of pizza. We have like some tomato sauce inside. It's pretty good. Second one, pickled plum and seaweed. Let's try that. Let me try right now. I don't like it. It's terrible. It's really terrible. Fuck! Holy shit, I'm not like this for this kind of food you know like but this one I almost almost throw, throw up <laughs> but anyway I put that and I tried and it's terrible actually the last one just like rice seaweed and uh, beef good no problem pretty good one station called Shinbashi. No idea what is that but we need to make a transfer there. Of course you know it's like pretty big area but we need to go there. So we just found on the internet today it's having a kind of festival here in Japan in a temple called Iya Jinja. So not sure if it's true or not, should just get some details on Google and we are going there to check that. That's the temple, this one in the top, Iya Jinja, we are going there. arrive here and you see a lot of people pretty silent probably their brain there and wait for something to happen there is a TV showing something but kind of lost you know I don't understand what's going on it's really good you know they also have like some people just selling some food here just like a Japanese street food and it's really good to see because it's completely different than China and they have like kind of a barbecue and stuff like that uh, just one information guys if you come to this temple please pay respect because it's pretty serious you know you can come here and you have like all the way with the red things like it's amazing you can check the back you can make a photo in this way look how cool is that so we made it we finished here now we need to go and move to the other place and i like to come inside of family mart just to see the products here in japan like this one they have kind of blue pancake this is family mart look how many fast noodles they have here i'm here at family mart now i'm 
we've got some chicken sticks and let's try that. It's good, just chicken with barbecue sauce. If you guys know me, I never eat like seafood like for over 20 years. And I decided to just change my habits and eat like everything. So now here I have like smoked sh sh shredded squid. It's just like it's a pretty famous one. A lot of people like that, but I will try it. Now let's choose more. A big one. Let's try this one. Holy shit, that's too big. I'll try not. To be honest, it's good. The smell is bad, but but the taste is good. It's not bad. It's not something I love, but it's good to try. So this is the last one. The kind of chocolate with peanuts. I don't know. It looks less dark. Interesting. Here, one of the main streets of Tokyo. We are going to a park called Menji Jingu or something like this, and uh, it's pretty famous. So we're just going there right now. We just decide, unfortunately, rains today. So, but anyway, we go there, check that place. This street here is pretty. Interesting, you know, because they have like pretty a lot of minimalist buildings. You can see the the concrete, the design, like pretty clean shape, and they also have like some some leaves here that give this main street here like pretty interesting, like minimalist design. We are going to skate shop right now. There is a skate shop down over this street to check some products there because they like skateboard products and on the way to the park. shop you know like they have a lot of uh, signatures of all the pro skaters and I definitely suggest for people who are in Tokyo if you want to see something related to skateboard just come to this shop here so that's the main entrance of Menji Jingu that's the portal where you go inside of the park and yeah let's explore a bit of this place you know I heard it's pretty good I never been here before last time I was in Tokyo I didn't make it now it's damn here let's go and explore this place because at the door you just already have the, the vibe that's the, should be inside of that. Let's go check it out. That's a cool place, you know, like if you're in Tokyo, like bus Tokyo, a lot of buildings, cars and stuff like that. And you stop in this place, you say, wow, it's so peaceful, you know, especially when you walk in here inside of those gardens. And you have those beautiful tall gates, like the entrance one, that one is giant, like, I don't know how many meters that, but it's, it's, it's big, that's what I can tell you. We just arrived here at the main, not the main gate, the main gate over there, this is the, the temple gate, and we are going inside to check that. Let's see how beautiful it is inside. From outside, it's already expanded. Imagine inside. That's the main temple, like just 360, just to show you around. And yeah, it's impressive, it's pretty peaceful. What I like here in Japan most, because people don't speak so loudly, so they're very calm, they just talk very peaceful, very like uh, in peace, you know, that's what I want to say, very silent. two here for one for my family and one for a friend he's kind of uh, had some like health issues so I just decided to write some some something to him to wish him good recovery I did that and one shall will help us for my family This 
the street. It's not so crowded, but it's pretty beautiful. Especially because of the lights. So they have so many lights here, and uh, they, you can feel the environment, the vibe of this place is cool, you know. So that's why, and also. Like robot restaurants, they charge 8,000 to go inside. I don't know if I'm going inside, but from outside, you can have an idea. Look how cool is that! Amazing. But last time I was not here guys and it, this street is so amazing the lights the vibe you know like This should be like similar as Colson Road in Bangkok. I don't know but it's pretty fun You know like look at the lights the back and everything like so many people so many interesting people here Different characters of people like so crazy, you know Station famous for animation just over there. Just made it, it's amazing. This place, you guys just check it out. If you guys animation stuff, that's the right place. Guys, finish the video here. Yeah, today was great. We visited so many places here in Tokyo, but now we need to get a bus to Kyoto. So, when we go to the bus station, we are waiting for the train, and then that's it. Hope you guys like today. Yeah, that's a life in Tokyo. See you guys soon. Peace and love, and boom.